Welcome to part 50. Whoa. 50. It's Gene. What's up, Gene? He's uh, given us the rundown of all the stuff that happened. And, you know, given us some color commentary. He exists. He's done nothing He's wrong. Yeah. I mean, he alerted the military... Um, and that's why Colonel Richard showed up with his onion hair. Oh, I don't know. We'll probably have to burn the city down because there's no one to, uh, oh wait, we'll just find an acting mayor. Never mind. Yay. Hooray for the orphanage. Hey, come on, you help it's too. It's all links to us. Agate was also there. Yeah, I forgot. Agate was involved? Oh, what's happening with him? I don't Damn. know. Oh, fuck. That's no good. Oh, okay. So... Cool. We'll probably catch up with him later in the game or something. I don't know. Yeah, he's a big boy. Apparently he's been on that job for a while now because, uh... Uh, our... Our father asked us to take care of that. Daddy Cassius. Daddy Cassius hurt me more, I mean. What? Whoa, okay. I... I am a cop. Hey, that's my line. Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, what, hurt I'm me old. more, or I'm uncomfortable? Uh, yes. Okay. I'm lost. Where are we? Uh, talking to Gene. Oh, okay. Speaking of her father... Oh, yeah. Uh, how about that Deus Ex Machina that you pulled out of your ass? Oh yeah, yeah. this thing? Huh. It's weird looking. Let me see it. Okay. Hmm. Could, Could it, it be? be? The letters, Mason. So what gonna... do they mean? Yeah, pl please tell us something, Jane. Alright, fine. We'll move all along the story to figure out more about this dumb thing, I guess. Yeah. Well, I guess I know where our next location is. <laughs> Hooray! We got the recommendation! That's three down. Nice. Two to go. Because we defeated the mayor sound soundly... Ooh, worked there for, for a second. Uh, yeah, we get our recommendation, and we get mad cash. You mean hella bread? Hella bread. You both said the same thing, yes. Hell yeah, yeah look cash, at all that money we got. Bread. I know. We God got damn. hell of cash. You are kidding. Bread. Oh no, I wasn't. We're rich. As rich as, like, 16-year-olds can be. Yeah, you know. Come on, Chloe. Join us. Yeah. Become a full-time party member, just like Jack wants you to. Yes. Don't stay in school. Drop out. Yeah, come on. Well, she'll go to the checkpoint with us, at least. Oh. So, there's that. We did it. Chapter end. 
We did it, folks. Holy yeah, shit. Yeah, we did it. Yeah, we're only... Woo, buddy. 27 hours. Oh my god, it's been so long since we've seen this screen. Mm-hmm. 50 videos oh. later, 27 hours oh. of gameplay. Yeah, something doesn't... Actually, no, that... That's actually not too far off when uh, when you consider that the videos are about a half hour long each. And because that actually just means he doesn't have to grind a whole lot. Yeah? It's no, just, I don't usually grind a whole lot. It's just a lot of I score. might do like... Damn, I get... Oh, yeah, I, I get might it. do like one... Oh, yeah. Agate's here. He's chasing the black cladded men. Uh, yeah, I, there's not a whole lot of off-screen grinding. Uh, and I'll talk about it usually when I have to do it. And it's usually not very much of it. He can and he will. Yeah, he probably will beat the shit out of you guys. Damn, he just fucking exploded them. Yeah. Agate's no joke. I mean, he was like four or five levels above a... Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Oof. Who are you supposed to be? I'm Commander. Oh, wait, haven't we seen this one before or some shit? Hmm. Maybe. Yeah, this one was at the lake, uh, during the bows. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So, the Masked Commander would like us to go away, and they won't bother us. Except Agate's, you know, a hot-headed moron, and uh, would rather uh, take these guys into custody than, you know, not. Yeah. So anyway, these guys are gonna run off. <laughs> Your fight's with me! Are you guys ready for a DBZ fight? Oh, hell yeah. Um, sure. I wish we could actually do this fight. That would have been cool. It would have been. Like, just have us play a one on one playing as Agate. There's some story stuff that happens uh, out of it, so it makes sense for it to not be an actual fight, but. between blows, so. <laughs> Screw you! You don't know me! You don't know my don't know name! My, my name! name. Are they just gonna scream at each other? Okay. I mean, that is DBZ. Good. I told you. I'll talk, no shock. I'll talk, no shock. It was oh, an after shit. image. Shit. He used his shadow clone jutsu. That doesn't make any sense. Agate's the heavy blade. That's his fucking nickname or whatever. Heavy Blade. Okay, bye. He just pulled mm. a shadow from Sonic Adventure 2. There's no time for games. Farewell. And then just fucking chaos controls away. Basically, I mean... Yeah, basically. Does that mean this is the part where Agate gets arrested? <laughs> no, that's fine. Ooh. <laughs> For crimes he didn't Chapter commit. Three. The Black Orb Mint. The Black Orb This is just Final Fantasy yeah. VII. Black Materia, Black Orb Mint. This is the same thing. We've already had the Black Orb Mint. We're getting it checked on. 
That's the what the whole chapter's about. But now it's important. I mean, it's technically always been important. We've just, you know, forgot about it. I mean, how many times in an RPG have you gotten a key item and then forgot about it? All the time. Yeah. I remember every key item from every game ever. Bullshit. <laughs> I misread the Ruinians as Russians. Jack, you can't be doing that. Come on. <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. When did we get into real life? Oh. We got a burb. It's the bird. <gasps> there she is. It's Jack's girlfriend. Chloe. Chloe, you didn't need to come meet us on the bridge. And I'm not saying that to be an asshole like, hey, you didn't have to come see us off. I'm saying that because we're going to go back to the fucking school after we're done with this cutscene. Um... Yeah. So yeah, anyway, we're gonna go back to the fucking school before we move the story along, because... Hey, she's back. Uh, oh yeah, Chloe's here. Back in the party. Well, yeah. Because and ahead of Joshua, things. for some reason. Uh, I think that's just the default, because of... Uh, technically, she never left the party. Oh uh, yeah, that's true. that was all just cutscene. That is true. So, Yeah. Uh, there is another chapter of the book, uh, that you can get before you go to the checkpoint to move on the story, to move the story along. So, probably the slimmest amount of time, uh, that we've had for one of these chapters. Maybe the, the last one was pretty slim, too. Um, yeah. So, head back to the, the school before you, uh, move along in chapter three. We are still rocking just three characters in our party. We had four for a little bit. For a little bit. Well, we had, I, can uh... change. I can change that if you want me to. Is it just going to be... Can, you're just going to I... solo Estelle the rest of the game? Do it, you won't. I, I won't, because I literally cannot. No. Also, that would be pretty hard. These games are designed, you know, with the idea I mean, of at least having, you know... I mean, yeah, that's the point. A, yeah. It's a challenge. So anyway, you talk to... Purity here. Purity? It's a weird name. I know. Uh, apparently she's writing a no novel. She had a chapter of a novel. Yeah. Uh, yeah, come talk to Purity for... Uh, for the next part of our book. And that's all we need. Now we're gonna walk back. Yay. I mainly left uh, all the walking in because of that one level up. For uh, Joshua, because he leveled up. Mm -hmm. And also to give me time to talk about things. And also I like this song. Shut up. <clears throat> Alright, what if I said this? We yeah. will get a replacement party member sooner than it took us to get a third party member in Chapter 3. Or in Chapter 2. Yeah, alright. But we won't see them this part. Haha. -ha. Oh. I'm sorry. But in the next part... We might not see them either, I don't know. Oh, I'm not okay. gonna tell you. 
You have to watch the video to find out. That's how I keep these guys coming back for, for more. Alright, now we're ready to move on. Well, actually, we're not at the right screen yet. Alright, now we're ready to move on. Oh shit, we still have a fishing rod? Whoops. Oh yeah. Weird. I guess we gotta go to the bar. Alright then. Guess we're going back. Now... I like how the game actually has that as a thing to check for. Like, oh, you still have the fishing rod. You have to go return it. Now, question. Can you mm -hmm. actually go to the bar before that little cutscene and return it first and skip that cutscene? Or do you have to attempt to leave and then it tells you that you have to go back and do it and then you do it? Because I've had... I think you can return it after you're done with the side quest. Okay. Because it, all it is is it's tied to a side quest. It's not actually tied to a main quest that you have to do. Oh, okay. Because I know that some games, like, yeah. depending on the circumstances, they might force you to do something, but in order to do it, you actually have to go do something else and then be told you have to do that thing. And then there's other times where you actually can just do it first and then it'll skip over it if you don't have, if you've already done it. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure in this specific case, I literally forgot I had that fishing rod. Uh, and it was just like, the game was like, hey, you have the fishing rod. And you should. And that was all it is. Yeah, I, you shouldn't, because, fuck you. So anyway, we're at everyone's favorite, uh, place, the place with a b bunch of waterfalls. Yeah, we've been here like four times now, Estelle. Yeah, but fuck the Duke. Yeah, fuck the Duke. Just because he thinks he's going to be the next one in charge of the country doesn't mean that's true. Right, guys? Yeah, Estelle could become the queen. Yeah, sure. Hmm. I mean, what do you have to be? Blood, uh, blood relative of the current uh, person in charge? Probably. And the only person we know of is the Duke. It's not like the Queen had any other children that might have had children or some shit. Hmm. Thinking emoji. Estelle think. <laughs> <laughs> Estelle thinking emoji. Join our Discord server to use the Estelle thinking mo emoji for free. <laughs> yeah. It's there. It's there. We use it. Yeah. So yeah, talk to the specialist at a, the counter here to get your papers reviewed. And that is the point of no return for the game. Uh, you can no longer explore uh, the Ruan region anymore. It is cut off. Chloe is now seeing us off. Chloe is going to leave us forever. She will never oh. return ever again in the, the entirety of the franchise. Damn. I know you're lying, but <laughs> I'm gonna... He I'm knows gonna... I'm lying. Yeah. I'm very much lying. Is this the last time we see her in this game? That... I will not tell you. Oh, okay. We'll probably I gotta see. Keep you watching the let's play somehow. <laughs> we'll probably see her again, but she won't be a party member. Well, I don't know. That's probably it. Oh, hey, the gate's open. Oh, yeah. Cool. Oh, we might see her later. Yay. She's going back there. Oh. No! She has relatives there. So yeah, we might meet up uh, at that point. I mean, it's 
nice that she's going to join us again, but still. God damn it, we're back down to two again? I told you I was gonna make it happen. Stop. Yeah. I didn't lie. You didn't lie. And I'm 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 partially grateful for that and partially very much upset. Good. You should be. Why can't we have a full party? We did. For In like chapter four one. Fights. Yeah, but why can't we continue to have a full party? We gotta meet new characters. We have to build relationships with other people. People have lives outside of this party. Come on. I mean, I do like the fact that they, because characters, like, come and go, like, there's a little bit more realism as, like, you know, they they don't just drop their whole life to join your party, but still, at the same time, it's like, it's such a war to just keep a an actual full party. And we're losing that war, gentlemen. Oh, thank you. It's nice. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, Burb. Okay, bye. Alright, now that we got rid of those losers, let's party. So now we're gonna play time the for Chloe to be the main character. I was gonna say now the rest of the game is gonna be Chloe and her bird. Bird, bird. Landon, bird. would you play a short game starring the bird? Mm-hmm. In fact, I would prefer that. It's like Untitled Goose Game, but it stars that bird instead. I like how it has a name, but we still just call it The Bird. The Burb. Because the bird is the word. Does anyone want to question that conversation that just happened? Or would uh, you know Nope. Well... I mean, no questions. We'll learn more. We'll probably learn more about what happened later. Uh, Jesus. Land Landon dying is a signal that uh, no questions. Huh? I I don't know what you're talking about. So anyway, we're gonna move the story along now. Oh yeah, and <laughs> fucking smug. He still thinks Joshua has a crush on Chloe, which is cute. But that's not the person in the party that actually has a crush on Chloe. It's actually the bird. Jack, your thoughts? <laughs> I like her. She's cute. I mean, it was just like you know the first time we saw her, like in the part one in the intro. I was just like, oh, she's cute. I like her. And it's still true. Yeah. Oh yeah, Estelle was all worried about the kiss that they shared, but Josh was like, it was a stage kiss. <laughs> and, you know, Estelle's dumb. Estelle, goddammit. Hahaha. <laughs> So, that's the way Estelle swings, huh? Yeah, she likes Joshua. Moving on. In the next part, we will delve a little deeper into uh, this tunnel and... Maybe recruit a new party member to state Cloud's needs or whatever. Why can't we just have back the ones we had before? No. No.